All right, so we get this question a lot. You know, how does Everbee estimate the monthly sales? How does Everbee estimate the total sales? Where are we getting this revenue number? Where are we getting these sales numbers? How does it work? And it's a great question. And we get the question a lot. And I'll do my best to explain it here. So as you know, Etsy doesn't share much data. I wish they shared more, but they definitely don't share sales and revenue data with, with anyone. So we actually had to create an algorithm that takes the data that Etsy does share with us to make some detailed estimations. And it, it kind of works like this. Etsy provides us with a few things such as reviews, favorites, listing dates, prices, and a few other things. Our algorithm uses this information to make estimates, right? Occasionally they are off a little bit, but mostly on just newer listings or on listings that are converting higher or lower than the average listing for that category or type of product. So on newer listings, the estimates are off a bit, just a little bit more because, you know, it's still collecting data from Etsy and it doesn't have enough to go on to make a better estimate. So typically when estimates are higher on Everbee than they actually are in your stats or your shop, right? It's usually because similar listings have a higher conversion rate compared to yours. Conversion rate standards that, that we use in our algorithm, they vary on price, category, and many other things. And the inverse is also true, right? So typically if your estimates are lower on Everbee than what they actually are in your shop dashboard, it's usually because similar listings have a lower conversion rate. Right, so you're actually converting higher than than most of the other the listings in that you know that category or listing type. Okay, so every day we are analyzing the results and improving the estimates, but since Etsy doesn't provide actual data, our algorithm has to carry all the weight. So anyway, I just wanted to explain a little bit more about that. Let me know if you have any other questions, and I'll talk to you soon.